Hello there, I'm Eamon Holmes reporting for Sky News. We have an important story breaking, a Sky News exclusive, and we head now to Studio One at Sky Academy Skills Studio. Welcome to Sky News, good afternoon, and I'm Marcel Kuczynski. And I'm Chris Megler. Today's story is about David Cameron offended Donald Trump. The Prime Minister of the UK said that Donald Trump was an idiot and his ideas were stupid. Donald never took this well and replied by saying that if he becomes president, he will not feel welcomed in the UK and as a result, will not make allies with them. This scares the UK because we are, trying, we are currently trying to avoid a conflict with America. If, if Trump does become the president, the UK could be in a major trouble and as a result, World War III could happen. Mr. Cameron is very concerned for his country's safety and heavily regrets offending him. Currently, Trump still has a high chance of being elected, so it doesn't look bright for the UK. Hopefully, the two of them can resolve their issues before it's too late. We'll now pass you over to Robbie in Hollywood. Thanks, guys. I'm live today from the 2016 Oscars here in Hollywood, where I'll be trying to grab a quick chat with some celebs as they walk up the purple carpet. In the press recently, there has been a number of celebrity scandals resulting in many celebrities calling for the media to respect their rights of privacy. They're raising some questions over the sort of role models certain celebrities are for young people. Well, oh, here comes David Beckham. David, any chance you have yeah, a quick no problem, my son. How's the family doing? Not that great. The boys are doing well. It's been in a... It's been in the news recently about celebrities complaining about the lack of privacy. Do you get much privacy nowadays? Not a lot. Press is always following me everywhere, hiding in bushes and all sorts. It's getting the beginning to get a bit creepy uh, when the kids are playing outside especially. The increase in media interest has raised questions about the examples some celebrities set and the role models that they've been in. What's your opinion on this? Well, when you've got rockets like the Kardashians who are famous for being famous, only, ca only care about their makeup and hair than everything else in life. That's a shocking role model, especially for young, to lock oxygen in themselves. Thanks for your time, mate. I'll let you go. No problem. Here comes Chloe. Hi, Chloe. Hello. Sorry, I'm late. I'm just finishing my makeup. I expected that from you, lol. Do you get much privacy out and about? Sometimes I love the attention. It makes me feel very good about myself. I always get pampered. I always make sure that they get my good side. Puppies and kittens and unicorns and rainbows. America, yes. Well, an absolute rocket. Well, now back to the guys in the studio. I'm here all night bringing you more celebrity madness. Thanks, Robbie, for that. Report. My name's Christopher Irvin and I'm joined here by Richard Cunningham and Tam Lane. And in this section of the programme, we are discussing, is Gaz from Geordie Shore a celebrity or not? We will be speaking to Richard. What is, the, is your view on this matter? The reason I think he's not a celebrity is because he's never been on a real show, just a reality show. One person from Geordie Shore was on Celebrity for Brewer, so... Right. Now, Tam, calm down. We're just trying to have a calm news feed. Be positive. Sorry, I will calm down. I just don't see how he's not a celebrity. He's definitely not a celebrity. He's never done anything to be classed as a celebrity. Yes, he has. He's been on live TV for five years. That doesn't make him a celebrity. You see people on Jeremy Kyle once and... They aren't celebrities. But people that are on TV for five years and not just once in their life are famous. My mother has 23 followers on Twitter. That doesn't make her a celebrity. But he's been verified on Twitter that he, that means he's famous. You're a bloody idiot. Shut up. Right, everyone, stop it. Stop it. What? One more word for both of you and we'll wrap it up right here. You hear me? He is a celebrity because he's been on TV for five years. No, he's not. He, he's just not. Thanks, guys, for coming in. This has been a difficult... That's all we have time for, and I'll see you next time.
Thanks to the team reporting from Sky Academy Skills Studios. That's the end of our special report. I'm Eamon Holmes. Thank you for watching.